All right, welcome to the Sense Creed Odyssey. Hopefully this works. <laughs> All right, let's try a new game. I've never actually played this beyond the first mission. So like I've done this section before, but uh, I've never played beyond this. So everything beyond this point, even the later games is new. We are ready, my king. Tell me the Nekis. Have you ever gone fishing with your son? No, never. A soldier's life is all I've had the honor to know. <laughs> I would have liked to have gone fishing with my son. Later. No. <clears throat> Let us meet our fate, shall we? Mm, yeah, nice. Spartans! Every breath that you have taken has led you to this moment. Every drop of blood, sweat, and tear, all of it has led to where you stand right now. Well, Persians can I take him back? To make slaves of us all. I have a better idea. I say we drench the gods with their blood. What say you, Spartans? For our sons! For our daughters! For Sparta! I don't think that's possible. <laughs> Get it. See? Your bloodline ends today, Spartan! 
I'll get drunk on your blood as the crows feed on your eyes. You will try, and you will fail. Xerxes is the king of kings. All will bow before him after I crush you. Come, fool. Enough talk. Time to die. My son is more of a warrior than you. What's on the No match for a Spartan. Okay, let's try it again. We are betrayed, my king. Xerxes knows of the path behind the mountain. They are coming. <laughs> By dawn, you will be completely surrounded. We are Spartans. When are we <laughs> not? Spartans. That word will mean nothing. Xerxes wipes your bloodline from the face of I felt like he's gonna do that. Today was a day the Persians will never forget. Tomorrow is a day the world will remember. Finally. There was a renew. Wow, this is big, Layla. Do you really think it's the spear? This is the one. The book was almost right on top of it. I've never been so lucky in my life. Hmm? Okay, let's start her up. Are you sure we can trust this thing? I mean, the book could be just started, Victoria. You're the boss, boss. I'll prep it for you. I forgot she was part of the assassins now. Okay, so worth noting, I've made some changes since we're last in here. <laughs> There's no keeping up with the tech industry these days. I can crank up the simulation to maximum sensory synchronization if you're up for it. Huh. I mean, as I said, I always go normal. Just, I got nothing to prove. Let's take this one step at a time. Understood. If you're looking for something a little more intense, I can always adjust the settings for you later. This bit will let me know how much information will be fed to you during your time in the Animus. Yeah. <clears throat> Alright. Okay. Did a little research. I mean, I can be switched later, so I might just try the exploration mode. You don't need to worry about me. I've got this. A little autonomy never killed anyone. At least, I don't think so. Just let me know if you need assistance, and I can always add the helpers back in. Listen, Layla, before you go off, if this book is right, this spear, this story, it will change everything. You're putting a lot of faith in a fairly unreliable source. Historian or not, this guy wrote about magical objects and the will of the gods. He's not Homer. Herodotus was the first recorded historian, so there's a lot more truth in that text than you think. I mean, what better way is there of finding Isu artifacts than by trusting in the guy who claimed to meet an actual descendant? I know, but... I need you to trust me. You could be right. This spear, this book, it could all be crap. But something tells me it isn't, and I'm certainly not gonna let Abstergo find out first. You're right. We haven't got much to lose anyway. There's just one small problem. What is it? This manuscript is in rough condition, to say the least. The DNA found on the spear has identified two different individuals. You're going to have to pick which strand of DNA to pursue. The choice is yours. What?
Man. I mean, I did take a little bit of research into this, and there are, they said it was pretty much the same story. Uh, I am more leaning towards Cassandra. Just because. I don't know. You know, you usually get to play as a female. Mm, who cares? She'll help us find what we're looking for. I have a good feeling about this. I All right, boss. We're finally good thing. to go. 431 BCE, here we come. The start of Peloponnesian War. Good luck in there. No pressure or anything, but we're all depending on you. Abstergo isn't going to win this time. If what the book says is true and we do actually find the artifact, the assassins will finally have a chance to rise again. You can do it. Oh, and Victoria, read the book. It holds the secrets I won't be able to find on my own when I'm in there. Aye, aye, Captain. Alright. Alright, see how this begins. The Kefalania Island. Alright. Bond. Hey, shit face! Get down here! Mm -hmm. Cyclops got a message for you. Tell your boss he can stick it. That's for last week! <laughs> Malaka! The Cyclops said you like to act tough, so act tough! Get a little closer, and I will. You should know by now. The Is Cyclops it? always collects his debts. You have a lesson to learn. If the Cyclops wants to teach me, tell him to come here himself. Never mess with the Cyclops! Last week? So it looks like it's still blinking. This shit happens every week. I can't keep doing this. <whistles> nah. Thanks for the warning. <laughs> oh. What happened to you? It's nothing, Phoebe. All taken care of now. The Cyclops again, huh? Hasn't he learned his lesson yet? Apparently not. No. Of if course. Had assassin. Help yourself. You hungry too, Icarus? <laughs> Do you think Zeus would bless me with an ego like he blessed you, Cassandra? Maybe you could ask him for me. Hmm. No, why not? I'll try to put in a good word for you. Finally. So, what are you doing here? Oh, I almost forgot. Marcos is looking for you. What does that weasel want now? 
Don't know. He wants you to meet him at his new house. On his vineyard. What? A vineyard? Malaka. It's on the road to Sami. Mm -hmm. He says wine will make him rich. More options. Since when has he had a vineyard? Yesterday, I think. So, Marcos, who owes me drachmi, is buying vineyards. With what money? I don't know. Where can I find Marcus's new <laughs> beautiful estate? You know the statue of Zeus on Mount Ainos? It's south of that. Yeah. Well, I guess I owe Marcos a little visit. Thank you, Phoebe. <coughs> I'll go tell Marcos you're coming. Go, go. My head. Pretty let him live. Uh, carefully, it's almost dark. I'm reenacting in my head uh, how they approached. Yeah. Fun's over. Tell that one eyed freak if he ever sends you here again, I'm gonna cut out his other eye and feed it to my bed. I'll see Marcos as soon as I'm dressed. <laughs> I keep telling you, you you can't do that. Why? It's my farm. I can plant what I want. The grapes will die here. All of them. You have to forget what you know about the past, my friend. Together, we will revolutionize winemaking. Believe me, you will look back on this day and... Cassandra, thank the gods. Phoebe found you in time. About grapes? I can still hear you. I was worried I sick. You. The Cyclops sent his scum to find you. I think they mean you harm. I wish you would have told me that before they hit me. But that's beside the point. You bought a vineyard, Marcos? A vineyard? Why not? <laughs> I like wine, you like wine, everybody likes wine. Everybody buys wine. Why not from me? Because you don't know how to grow grapes or make wine? I'm a fast learner. You grow grapes on the vine, then you get some wine. <laughs> is that simple, is it? You know me better than to think I don't have a plan. Marcos always has a plan. Not a good All plan. Right. Then do you have the money you owe me? Do I have the money I owe you? <laughs> of course, of course. Well, no, not at the moment. Then get it. Instantly, my friend, instantly. But uh, maybe you should do that. There is a merchant in Sami. I'm not very good at these things, as you know. You want me to collect my own debt? It's just waiting for you and Sami, my friend. Who's the merchant? Luris. You know Luris. He's very nice. Yeah. Luris? Again? Why do you keep lending him money? He's a loyal friend. I don't want his family to starve. You're a good friend, but you're bad with money. Mm. How do you want to handle this one? Not like you handled that olive oil business. That was... Uh, that was too much. I got the money. And now mm. we'll never get any more from him. If you kill them all, nobody benefits. Threatening them, and maybe more. Breaking things, certainly. Steal the money if you have to, but don't rob me of my customers. Unless you can't avoid it. These things happen. It's understanding, at least. Where can I find the race? In a shop in Sami, overlooking the docks. You know this, Cassandra. Will he be there? You mistake me for the Pythia. I couldn't possibly know. He'd better have my money, Marcos. I'd hate to have to sell our vineyard. 
Of course he will. Oh, after there's another matter I want to discuss with you. After. Fine, but I'm taking a horse. It's too hot and too long a walk to go on foot. But think of it as interest, mm -hmm. Marcos. Everybody benefits. Of course, my friend. You shall have your pick. Tell me about this Is one. Friend? The Skiros. You have an eye for sturdy stock, my friend. That horse can cling to mountain passes like a god. Third. The one in the middle. Tell me about it. Ah, you have picked a beauty, my friend. That horse is from the Salonia, bred for its courage. Huh. I like the look of the one on the right. Ah, the Macedonian. These are bred for battle. A true warrior's horse. I've made yeah. my choice. Which one will it be? I won't. No. I'll take the one in the middle. Ah, uh, a uh, uh, fine choice. But this particular breed has a few quirks that you might not be aware of. I wouldn't want you to take an unworthy horse. <laughs> this is the one I want. Are you sure? Because... But I'm sure, Marcos. Everybody benefits, especially you. You've chosen the great Phobos. He's never let me down. Phobos. Remember, <laughs> meet me at the temple in Sami when you have uh, your money from Duris. Ah, F therapy. There's plenty of wine left to buy. Don't fret. Not now, you fool. Phoebe has been taken. By who? Thugs of the Cyclops. Who else? Snatched her right off the main road. Tell me where they went. In the direction of Itimena Beach. The beach? Can she swim? I'll get her. Yes, go. But don't forget about dear Duris, Cassandra. <sighs> yeah, I let's go. Got you. Okay, same, same as the origins. Let me go! Shut it! Or I'll tighten those ropes! She'll make good ransom drachmi for the Cyclops. No one's gonna buy me from you. They're all poor. Keep quiet, Phoebe. No. Hmm. This tall grass will keep me hidden. of those Malakias get away. Oh, let's go faster. Huh? I heard something. Looks like it was nothing. Oh. Ah! Marcos is going to be next. Time to get Phoebe out of here. Are you all right? It wasn't so bad. Last time they put a cloth in my mouth so I'd stop biting. Phoebe, just be careful. You're alone now since... Since my parents died? I'm okay. I've got you and you've got me and Marcos. We're your family, right? The flashback. You'll have to be stronger than that. Don't give in! Let him have it! 
Got you. <laughs> Again. Up. Yes, Pater. A Spartan rises as soon as they have fallen. Ready or stop. I mean. Widen your stance. A soldier grounds themselves. Hmm? Good. Good. Uh. Approach me. Ah! That's enough, Nikolaus. The sun's going down. Time to eat, don't you think? <laughs> What are we eating tonight? Tonight yeah. we are having baby Alexios. <laughs> and what a feast he will be. No, not him. Take me instead. I'm tasty. Yes, yes, you're all sweet as honey. Now, come inside. The lamb's turning black. Here. Lay him in his bed. Yes, Pater. Cassandra. Hmm. You are my greatest pride. Remember that. You will bring this family to glory. Go. Hmm. I wonder if it's fledged if you uh, if you pick the other one. Right. You worry too much. <laughs> you don't worry enough. We'll be all right if we watch out for each other. Which reminds me, the thug said you should watch your back. What'd they say? They said the Cyclops put a big bounty on you. Talos the Stonefist wants you dead. Talos the mercenary? Am I ever not in trouble? Better get him before he gets you. I hear he's really mean. I'll find my way back to town. Here! No way. I can probably get up easily. The stone fist has just what I need today. Another broken nose. I'm going to have to take care of that. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to be a bad guy. Usually, the Cyclops won't accept payoffs. The list. Hello, Luris. Business looks good. Tell Marcos to come down here himself, if he wants his money. Huh? No, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marcos says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. Yeah. Double? That's robbery. That's what I told Marcos. You know him, he's extreme. If you pay him, this will all be over with. You told Marcos I've paid enough already. I won't bow to, to, to a mercenary or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Look, I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. Mm -hmm. You're right about that. Forget the drachmi. Marcos and I need to have a talk. You're letting me go? Then at least take this yeah. sword. Nothing special, but it's better than that rusty one you've got. With the Cyclops involved, I'll need it. You better set Marcos straight, or you're both dead. Yes, but I mean, trading it for information. Got a job to do, Cassandra? The uh, have a bow to take those guys down. Okay. You're 
running out of time until the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he docks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. You can't hide behind your glories, Mistios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the drachmi. Good, or I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Cassandra, I can tell from the smile on your face, Duris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back, can't we? I'm sure it's possible. Yeah, it will take okay. a lot of work. And even then, I'm not sure. We have no option but to try. Then you'd better be willing to help. I won't do all the dirty work. <sighs> I long for the old days. Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Don't see fishes like you every day, eh? <laughs> oh. <laughs> you hungry? How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Huh? Think about it. Wait! Mm. <laughs> Kefalonia. Some gift. You were nothing without Marcos. And look how far we've come. From an orphan on the streets to a Mistheos with a hovel. And now the Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. I mean... Look at you. How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Skulking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you! You were? <laughs> I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakes stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can't. Why, I was just filling my friend Cassandra in on the details. She already has a plan to deal with these bandits. You know me. Always prepared. What did I tell you? She will leave no stone unturned. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits. Today! A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Cassandra, I've cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. If you want your wood, you'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. 
These balls will make me rich as Chrysos. They're that good, are they? The war's brewing. The Athenians need good bows if they want to hold off the Spartans. Everybody benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marcos? You should be tired of this small-time shit. You'd make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you're a secret Spartan. That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonia. Hand it over. There you go, good as new. That bow is as strong as Heracles himself. Give it a try. Shoot your arrow at those dummies. No. Fair is fair. Are you going to get my wood? Those fucking bandits need a thrashing. Fair is fair. I'll fix your wood problem. Finally! Marcos sure is lucky he's got you as his scapegoat. Any idea no. where these bandits are? I'm not a tracker, I'm a boyer. They're in the mountains somewhere, that much I know. I'd check close to the lumber camps. There's plenty of trees around. Why do you need this type of wood? I've been working on a new type of bow. It's more flexible, so it lasts longer and can fire at greater range. Only a very special kind of wood that grows high in the mountains will do. Makes sense. I'll take care of the bandits. Make sure that you do. And be quick about it. <laughs> I'll deal with these bandits and get you the wood you need as fast as I can. Have patience. It won't take long. Ha! <laughs> if you knew how long Marcos has been feeding me excuses, you wouldn't be saying that. All right, I did something for you. Now you do something for me. Get my wood! Hey, we're all getting an experience here. I just need to find out what I need to use it for. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's what I'm looking for. The automatic looting. So you're saying he didn't die. Anyway. So, is it separate? Even... Oh, there's multiple. Here's where the ambush happened. I should look around. That's a lot of footprints. Right. A group left this area, headed west. Okay, then I get a return on arrows. The cart was emptied, then left behind. The thief can't have gotten far with that much cargo. Shot in the back while fleeing. Must be the work of bandits.
firing from over here. I've got this. Better take some lumber back as proof. That old bag won't just take my word for it. Oh look, it's Marcus's mighty champion. <laughs> Don't tell me you actually did what I asked. I tracked the bandits and sent them to Addis. Your wood should arrive in town soon. And you expect me to believe the word of a mercenary? I didn't expect you to believe me, so I brought this. Here's your proof. A sample of the special wood you want so badly. These bows you're making had better be worthy of Apollo for all the trouble I've gone to. By the gods! <laughs> you sure you work with Marcos? He's never once delivered on a promise. Incredible. I might work with him, but we're nothing alike. I'm true to my word. Then take your pay. Give none to Marcos. <sighs> Mighty Kefalus, I entreat you, send us a champion. Someone worthy of your mighty spear. Help your priestess in her hour of need. Mm -hmm. I'm the only one here. But maybe I can help you. <gasps> oh, Cassandra, you startled me. Why are you looking for a champion? I need someone worthy to win the Spear of Kefalus. I've been deciphering some of the sanctuary stone carvings. They say the spear was hidden in the caves beneath Kefalonia when the temple was built. You could get it for me, couldn't you? I can give you a reward. If the spear is <laughs> in the caves, I'll find it. Well, maybe you were sent by Kefalus. Kefalus had a spear? Cassandra, surely you've heard this story since you were a child. I didn't have much time for stories. Well, perhaps you didn't. But you know Kefalus founded Kefalonia and started the line of Odysseus. His spear was a gift from the gods. It was said never to miss its target. He must have hidden it in the caves after killing his wife with it. He threw a spear that wouldn't miss at his wife? He was hunting and heard her in the bushes. He thought she was a deer. It's a sad story. Sounds dangerous. Well, only if you throw it at someone. Mm -hmm. Why do you need a spear? Not thinking of becoming a soldier, are you? Of course not. But think how many people will come to the shrine if we have the Spear of Kefalus. With their donations, I could do so many things. Repair the sanctuary, feed the hungry families in Sami. So, where is this spear? Apparently, it's hidden deep in the caves beneath Kefalonia. There's an entrance north of here. Maybe you can try that way first. That's not much to go on. You have so little faith in the gods. If Kefalus means for us to have the spear, you will find it. I'll see what I can find. Oh, thank you. I'll prepare a spot in the sanctuary. Try to stay out of sight.
Alright, the next one. Cassandra, have you come back to talk about the spear? I have. Oh, good. Tell me, did you find it? What's a scale mean? Consider it a donation to the temple. What? No reward? Oh, Cassandra, I'm in your debt. If ever there's a way my temple can help you, or anyone, send them here. I will remember. Okay. Sammy, I wonder if we'll be able to leave without getting into a brawl. Oh my kidding. This place never changes. Uh. What's your plan? Ah, here you are, and not a moment too soon. I've dealt with the bandits, and gotten the wood for the boyer. I had every confidence in you, my friend. Well, your plan? Right. The Cyclops and I have a score of drag me to settle. The same score as you, my rough and tumble friend. He wouldn't be after me if it wasn't for you, my friend. <laughs> eh, right. But, I swear, this will put an end to it. If he insists on sending his goons after us, we'll make sure his last good day was yesterday. Let's hear it then. Yeah. What do I have to do? What will we do, you mean? As the brains to your brawn, I consider it a joint effort. <laughs> of course you do. Think, what does the Cyclops value most? His men? His land? His ships? No! His obsidian eye! Get to the point, Marcos. I mean... Oh, fine. We're going to steal it. Are you crazy? You borrow his drachmi, then you steal his eye? Having it means we win. Then it goes to market. We kill two birds with one obsidian eye. <laughs> He'd better hold still. Or he'll lose both eyes. No, no! It has to be done without the Cyclops knowing. You cannot be seen. Then my new bow will come in handy. He keeps the eye in his house. It's too valuable to wear out. A wise choice until you show him the error of his ways. Wait for the sun to set, sneak in, and then bring me the eye. Hmm. Better be worth something. Do you know how much obsidian goes for in Kefalonia? I've, I've never seen it. Exactly. And not only is it obsidian, it's veined with gold. Gold! It's no wonder he saves it for special occasions. So we'll use the profits to pay him off. It will pay for the bulk of it. A vineyard's expensive, you know. I don't know where the Cyclops lives. Keep to the west side of the island. There you will find his lair. Fine. But you won't get away with being cheap. Cheap? You wound me, Cassandra. It's your defining trait. Bring me the eye and I'll prove you wrong. Remember, not a soul can see you. Got it. Pull this off and our heads won't be the Cyclops' trophies when he comes back. Yeah. Careful, I need cover. If I'm quiet, I can hide in the bushes. Am I to have that much protection? I have to stay out of view. Yeah.
Well, can't see a thing. Stay sharp. Be back. We have to be ready. If they return, they will not escape with their lives. Ah! I'm ready for you. You guys, I haven't lost you for long. Yeah, whatever. I be careful! Do you know how many of his guards were there? Considering how many showed up here? Yes! What did I say about being seen? At least you taught them a lesson. All for a fucking rock. This rock could buy a house, my friend. And yet, it's still not enough to pay back the Cyclops. Oh, don't be upset. Think of all the fun we've had. The Cyclops is going to kill us, Marcos. It's as simple as that. And there's nothing fun about it. This will work, no. I promise you. Would I lie to you? Don't make me answer that. Take the eye, but don't sell it yet. No vendor would believe we came by it lawfully. They know exactly who it belongs to. Fine. Better your pocket than his socket. I think that's enough for one day. Quiere, Marcos. Uh, wait, I saw a boat. One I've never seen before. So? The vessel's too good for this dirty town. It must be the Cyclops, and he brought friends. He's back? Ugh. I can never catch a break, can I? Take them out, and that's one less thing to deal with. 
Besides, these strangers look rich as Chrysos. The Cyclops pays them well. It's win-win, my friend. It can't hurt. What do I have to lose? You? You're a winner if I ever saw one. Then where are they? In an abandoned house on the eastern coast. Who knows what golden fortunes shine in their hideout? Send them to Hades, then loot them for all they have. We'll be rich. There's so many ways to go wrong. The eastern coast. Can you be more specific? I think they've settled in an abandoned house by a small forest south of Sami. So, if these visitors aren't from Kefalonia, where did they come from? All I know is Kefalonia will be the last place they'll ever see. I'm keeping right. some of these golden fortunes, though. No negotiations. Not even a drachme for the man who sent you? The rest goes to pay your debt. These are my terms. Oh, fine, fine. Now teach those strangers what it means to be Kefalonian. Draw blood or bleed. See there's any skills I want. Or heading in. I should be careful. High security here. Who's that? I don't think they came this way. Find them now, or I've got you myself. They'll regret the name of the cross. Ah! Yeah, there's all the newcomers. Uh -huh. I normally have someone else do the field work. I don't suppose you know how to get this stain out. It comes with the territory. Then you're just the mysterious I'm looking for. A clean slaughter. Very good work. Not much sympathy for the men who work with you. Not with me. For me. Employees. Now ex-employees, I suppose. Mm. So you don't work for the Cyclops? Your kind are unusually believers of myth. Not the monster, the man. You are an outsider. Why are you here? Indeed, I'm not from Kefalonia. I'm here because what I'm looking for is. It's very shiny. If you'll follow me, 
Cassandra. Who are you? How do you know my name? I'm Elpinor of Kira. How do I know your name? I did what you did. I asked and people told me. Tell me who sent you. An inquisitive nature. Good. That will help. You know more than you let on. Knowing you is in my yeah. best interest. And knowing me is in yours. My prized possession was stolen and brought to Ithaca. Penelope's woven shroud. I need you to steal it back. The Shroud of Penelope? The wife of Odysseus? You're joking. A piece of it, yes. Impossible. If it existed, it would be priceless. Which is why I want it back. <laughs> Ithaca is not a small island. I need more information. I'd start at the home of Odysseus. Well, what's left of it? An inspiring tale. A reunion of past lovers. All right. I'll do it. Don't expect it to be easy. That's why it will cost you. Then it's agreed. There's a rowboat in the harbor. Use it. It's not meant for open water, so be wise. When you have the shroud, meet me in the Temple of Zeus. I will. Oh, and Mystius. Don't fail. to the house of Odysseus on a tiny boat. Let's try not to piss Poseidon off, shall we? You should have turned down this bounty, Thanos. <laughs> 